Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys all so very much for joining me. I hope you guys are having the most wonderful day. Today's video is all about b and M. I I haven't been to b and M. I I think in a little bit. Um, so I decided to go see what they have. I don't really have a huge haul for you guys, but I do have a little bit of few bits and pieces. First thing that I picked up was this Mickey and Minnie bag because it is too cute and I loved it. Um, so I had to buy it. These bags are only a pound, which I think is really, really good because they're good quality. They are sturdy and they are super pretty. So guys, let's have a look at the first item that I purchased. So I've decided that I want to start creating a nice little beauty area for myself. I don't tend to have somewhere that I have a beauty area. My makeup and cosmetics tend to stay in a bag. It is a nice bag. It's a Victoria's Secret makeup bag. Um, but I would like to see what I have. Um, sometimes it's difficult if it's all in a bag and it's all together. So I purchased this eight um, compartment um, cosmetic little um, multi-purpose caddy. It was $1.99, which I think is a great bargain. But I'm not going to use, I'm going to use this for my makeup. I don't even know if you guys can see through this because it's acrylic. But I thought that my brushes could go in this little section, some of my eyeshadows in here, foundations, and uh, maybe some some of my primers on either side. I love the fact that it has a little handle. Um, and I am going to buy more of these and start building up my little beauty area. To really have a beauty area, it's more like the top of my um top of my unit, but it's at eye level, so I can see everything. Um, so I purchased this. I think this is pretty nifty. Um, and if this does the job, I think it's going to do. I think $1.99 is probably um it's it's definitely a good bargain. Because I'm just going to pull this off to the side. Although I'm so disappointed you're not going to see the mini Mickey bag. Because it is cute. Let's push it right in there. Okay, so the next thing I purchased was some snacks. <laughs> My um, nephew loves these little monster wheels. I don't know why, but he does. And they're only 59p. They're salt and vinegar little um, snack wheels. Pro he probably likes them because of the um, of the dinosaur. Um, but I just purchased some snacks. These are made by Layla. I think Layla. I'm not sure. But they are actually really good. They have a really good salt and vinegar flavor. But my favorite are, and I purchased... I am making a whole lot of noise. My favorite are these. Do you remember these? <laughs> and these are Swizzles raindrops. They're just puffs of corn or um, not really puffs of what? Puffs of maize and rice. So it's sugar coated puffed maize and rice. I love these. I love the fact that they're um, so light, but they're super crunchy. And I also like the fact that um, if you're on a diet, which I am, my life is an eternal diet, that they aren't really that high in calories. So you can get that sugar hit. You can get that crunch. You can feel like you're, you know, you're having um, something nice and sweet, but the calories are just not there, which is awesome. So they're my favorite. I also bought the kids some of these because they're too cute. Are these Millions Whirl Pops. Um, I don't know what it is about these can candy pops that add swirl around, but the kids, the kids love them. They're better. They, they love them better than the normal lollipops. So I buy them these and um, they're a pound a bag. Oh, guys, by the way, the rainbow drops are um, only 39p for that massive bag, just so you know. And um, so these are a pound for 10 lollipops, which I think is, is pretty darn good because you're getting quite a bit in, in this. You're getting, you have got um, tropical. Tropical Aubrey. Aubrey. You've got blue blue bubble gum. You've got Hue Blue. And um, you've got Pip, which is Apple. Very funny. You've got Aubrey, strawberry, and you've got Brianna banana. So you've got banana, you've got strawberry, you've got apple, bubble gum, and tropical. So you're getting two of each lolly, which I think is a lot of fun. And I don't know why the kids love these. It's something to do with the swirl. I'm not sure, but they tend to like these a lot better than any other lollipops that I buy for them. Guys, I picked up two of these. Um, Little Mermaid um, scratch foil art. I thought what I could do with these is maybe do a video 
um, sort of craft time video. I don't know. Let me know in the comments section below if you guys want to see um, maybe a bit of arts and crafts. Not art, because I am not good at art, but crafts on my channel. But I just thought if you guys thought it would be fun and we could maybe do something, please let me know in the comment section below. If you're not interested, that is not a problem. I can also keep these and put these in with the little charity packs. But these were only 80p, which I thought, no, these were 85p, which I thought was fine. I mean, um, 85p for, you know, a little art set isn't too bad. I picked up two. Um, inside the kit, you get the scraper tool, a practice sheet. You get four uh, pre-printed scrapper foil pictures which I mean four for 85p I mean I think that's a decent little um activity so I purchased those um guys like I mentioned this isn't a huge haul um so we're going to try and get through this haul I'm actually going to take everything out of the bag and then I can put the little mickey bag back so you guys can have something cute to see oh my gosh Back you go. Beautiful. So, guys, oh, let's move you over here. Um, again, I love buying um, travel accessories. I use them all the time. I go on not a couple of vacations, but usually like day trips or overnight stays. And I do like these um, little travel sets because it makes it easy for me not to have to bring full size bottles of anything. And um, so this little kit was a pound. You're getting two little um, tubs. I usually use one for my vitamins. Um, which are quite small and I use the other one for a little bit of my foundation um might sound strange but I decant my foundation into the little tub and I bring it with me I put some shower gel some conditioner and some shampoo um and for a pound I mean I think that is pretty I think that's pretty sweet um I do tend to buy a lot of those a lot a lot a lot and staying on the travel theme I also purchased two sets of luggage tags I noticed the last time that I went on holiday that a lot of the bags seem to look similar. They are not similar, but they look similar. Um, and I struggled to find my bag. So I want tags on it this year because I'm going to be able to um, readily know which one's mine. So um, I picked up these Travel Shop 2 luggage tags. Um, they were... Um, they were $1.99, so 99 pH. And I mean, I think that's pretty darn relative. So not unhappy about that. Um, and it says, don't touch me, hands off my case. You can then also on the, <coughs> excuse me, on the other side, put your name, telephone and email so that if your bag is lost, it's easily located. And I mean, I think they're pretty good. I personally would have pref preferred maybe um, a brighter color. This is all they had. And that's what I picked up. And I'm okay with that again staying on the travel I mean you might not think this is travel but for me it is I always try when I before I go on holiday to build up a tan I don't have patience to sit and I, I won't I don't do some beds nor will I do some beds um I don't sit out in the sun um I don't have patience to sit around all day tanning I just I just don't I don't understand um why I don't I know a lot of other people love and enjoy that I find it I find I get bored really, really easily. Um, so I usually fake my tan. Um, this Nivea Sun Kissed Skin Gradual Tan Body Lotion I've never used before. Um, but I bought two. I think I bought one in another haul, which I'm still waiting to use. Um, but I bought another one just to have it. So I can't even at this moment give you um, uh, any indication as to whether it's good or it's not. If you guys know, let me know in the comments section below. I would be really interested in your feedback. Um, but I'm hoping um, to start. I've got a month until I go on holiday. Um, so I'm, I'm hoping to start um, building up my tan. This little Nivea tan was £2.59. I don't think that's a bad deal. Um, I don't think that's a bad deal because I'm getting 400 milliliters. So I think I, I got a pretty decent deal there. Um, guys, I could not walk past these. Um, these are unicorn rainbow <laughs> sugar waffle cones. I purchased two boxes of these. One is already gone. These wafers are so cute. Um, and when my nephews came to the house, they saw them, they dived into them and they devoured them. Um, but they're really, really, really cute. Um, and I just think it makes an ice cream a little bit more fancy. These are only 99p for set for nine. I keep saying six, nine. 
And I think that is pretty darn awesome. And, and also because they are really cute. What I loved about them is that they're sturdy. So when I opened the box, I assumed that one or two would be broken. Nothing was broken. So I'm really, really happy with these. And I just think they're too cute and too adorable. Um, what else? The last thing that I purchased, um, guys, are these. I don't know if you have used Fabulosa products. They are one of my top cleaning products. I mean, if I showed you my cleaning cupboard, you would see Fabulosa all over the place because it is fabulous. Um, these are um, washing machine cleaners. I never really thought about washing my machine until I saw these. I mean, these I've used these before. Um, but until I saw them in the pre the previous time I purchased them, and now I, I use them every week. Um, but these are these are so good. I think you get two shots, so this cleans your washing machine twice. So I clean my washing machine once a week. So this does me two weeks. So this is going to this is going to do me two months, which I think is fantastic. Um, I picked up two. Um, one is called Angel Flower, which smells delightful, and Free Spirit, which also smells delightful. These are 99p. No, I'm not. They, they're not. These are a pound each. Um, and I just think that Fabulosa has become, honestly, my new cleaning, my new cleaning staple. Well, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this little short video. I have had a blast showing you guys what I picked up. I hope you have really enjoyed me showing them to you. Um, if you guys did like this video, please hit that like button. If you're not yet a subscriber and like to join us, please go ahead and hit that um, subscribe button. We would love to have you here. And if you want to be notified of any of my future videos, just hit the notification bell. Guys, please take care. Please stay safe. Please look out for each other. And I'm going to catch you next time. Take care, everybody. Bye.